The plan is to build a monorail that goes from this base to this base to this base. So the first thing I want to do is build an elevator. And to do that, I'm going to take these pieces, which don't look that pretty, truth be told. But it'll make my building life easier. I could use something different, or I could simply do this and cover it with some kind of flooring. I'll do it like that. Perfectly flush up at one. I'll do that for all of them. Now, the way I'm going to go ahead and stack them, because I want to build it a little high, nothing too crazy, just a smidge. I'm just going to build stairs. That seems like the best way to do this. And these stairs are easy to stack. Okay, that wasn't very flush. It doesn't need to be that much higher than this. I'll probably do two more rows. Dude, it actually has to be so high. I think it low-key has to be even higher than this. That's crazy. Now, surely it doesn't have to be much higher than this. Surely. Oh, it's a... Ah, I forgot this is here. And now I actually have to build it even higher because the distance I want... I gotta give it like an actual topper. You know not even mad about that. I can break it instantly. Oh, come on. What even occurred here? I'll just do the, the generic topper I've been I've been doing. You place this right here. You go over until only one thing's showing. And you go over one. And then make it easy on yourself. I need to be able to see what I'm looking at here. So I'll use a different 16x16. 16 16, make it wood. And now that it's wood, I'm going to go ahead and use... I'll use concrete. I think concrete makes the most sense. Use a concrete 8x8. Eight eight. That's the middle. I feel like that is the middle, but I do not quite know. Oh, that's definitely not center. Oh my god. That's one way to not mess it up. Place one more, and now I need flex wood for my small tires. That's so much easier than grappling the actual thing. You don't really get any retries with tires. And I'm off center. Okay, the stopper at the top is set in place. This base is already pretty concrete because it's in the desert. I will just do this. Put a llama up there. Swore I heard llama. Okay, now I need thrusters. But first, I'm going to go ahead and build my supports. A rustic pillar. And build the topper. So I need blast powder and wooden rods. Because I'm adding small thrusters. I may add a big one. I'd have to do some experimentation here. The big one could be the play. But for now, we'll keep it cool. We'll keep it simple. Do I have more thrusters? I could add a lot more. If I add one right here, it still keeps the symmetry, I, I believe. For balloons, place them right there. Right there. There and there. The tires are still there. It's a lot of power. That is a lot of power. The only thing that could be bad here is that I do have a lot of thrusters. I have eight small thrusters on the bottom. I wonder what kind of math it takes to have only like maybe like one big thruster is equal to 
four or something. Yo, get a yeah 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 yo yo yo. Wanna go for a ride, Petra? I got you. They're all on the outside. Should be zero effect on the actual cart. This one. This is the one. Alright, so this is the height I'm looking for to begin my, my trolley, my tram. The idea is to try and have this go around the whole thing. That way, if I want to go that direction, I can. That direction, I can. That direction. But this is this is fine for now. We'll just keep it like this. And now I just want to see how it feels. Yo, Petra is... Yo, lag? Didn't die, though. That's good. Petra's just chilling here. I mean that's that's safe. I feel I feel comfortable doing that. Why can't I build this? On the outside, go! Be gone! Outside! Okay, well. Now it begins <laughs> I think I need more I need more than 116 concrete. I'm gonna go farm some of that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I can make it from here all the way over here. I want to go next to, like, I guess in between the cave and this little house in the Frostlands. I don't think I can make it with 116 concrete. I'll be back. Maybe it's just me, but I think one of the best places to farm stone is either going to be in the Frostlands or in the Dry Valley. And with the recent discovery of the grappler, the, the geyser grapple, I kind of like the idea of farming in Dry Valley more. So I have almost 600 granite. I, I farmed like 376 and I gathered whatever I had in the chests. But now begins the journey forward. Oh no. What the? Have your pickaxe out. Safer that way. To my left is the base I've built the most. I'll probably showcase that at a different time. I kind of like this area. I could build an elevator going up here, and I probably will. And I could then build a triumph going that way, but I ain't gonna do that. I have to go further than that. This works for now. I gotta build an underview to actually see what I'm doing. At first, I'm gonna make one. Because I want to have both ends connected in case something breaks. Because you never know, man. Maybe folks are right about this. It is a bit easier building like this. Because you can snap on. Snap onto that now. Disagree. I'm out of wood. Oh. <laughs> well, I agree now. I thought I couldn't build because I feel like uneven. If you add this small beam, you have to break it. If you don't break this, is GG. Okay, you know, I don't like that I broke. I hit that. Restarting. And now there's no need to break anything. That's lined up. I'll place it like that. You can add chests later. It shouldn't be a big deal. I'll add chests later. I know my plan. Oh, we're not doing that. We can't be lagging like this, dude. That's the plan. Okay. And surely it doesn't break. I mean, <laughs> yeah, it didn't break yet. I think when I hear that... The weird metal that thing. Wait, 
Okay, we're good. I looked at the bottom and I saw it was not flush and I thought I messed up because brain deficiency. We're good though. I'm not going to get super close to here because what I want to do is have some room to build the side that goes the other way. That's good enough. We made it here in one piece. Noise. Okay, uh, I was over there for a reason and I forgot what it was. Can I do a reverse railroad thing and not get decimated? Stay tuned to find out. And just to keep the symmetry going down by that much. Okay. These should connect and not break. Oh my goodness, it's so clean. It's so unbelievably clean. Um, and it seems, it seems to be, why is it doing that? And the, the noise, you see, yeah, usually means absolute destruction. We are fine. But hey, we made it back. We made it to and fro in one piece. I'd say it's working pretty good. Do elevators and monorails break in survival? Let's go ahead and find out. I built this in my own world. Survival, all the basic settings. It hits that roof so roughly though. So far, that's looking good. We'll break on the way back. We'll find out. We got two, we got front and back, to and fro monorails. So far, it's going fine. Does this sound brutal? Yes. I've done this a few times now and it hasn't broken. And it sounds the exact same way on Sandbox. So. Oh my god, this food, dude. Food, by the way. It's burning my freaking lap. I just put it in the microwave. I, I don't think there's a difference between the structural integrity of things in Sandbox versus Survival. But people in the comment section will not stop saying, Um, sir, that's gonna break, dude. Like, <laughs> that's gonna break? It's gonna get stuck? I've been testing, bro. This might still break though, you never know. It's getting kind of catty with Wampus. Okay. I'm not sure why this one breaks. I'm gonna be completely honest. I believe I solved the problem. I now use four thrusters like normal on each of the corners and it works just fine. I can go to Narnia and come back, it's great. Before I had eight thrusters and then six thrusters and it was it was nice that it, 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 went, it flew so fast but it would just be broken whenever I went far away and then came back on the uh monorail i will probably build this place out a lot more here soon but for now that's it for the video thanks for watching have a good day peace